Out eight of the evening here at Muay Thai Grand Prix. This start proudly brought to you by Johnny Two Thumb. Five by three minute rounds in the 67 kilogram super welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He is trained by the team at GTG with an official weight of 66.5 kilograms. He has a record of 72 fights with 59 wins and 13 losses. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Lotus. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He is trained by Jane Bertolame from Monsters Inc. With an official weight of 66.6 kilograms, he has a record of 19 fights with 11 wins and eight losses. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Black Panther, Nilsson Lackey. Fighters, please seal the ring. Thank you very much, CJ. Fighters are sealing the ring, and this bout is proudly brought to you by Johnny Two Thumb, your custom tattoo experts. They're based in Myree. You can find them at 47 McCoy Street in Myree. And go to johnnytoothumbperth.com. And another thing is amazing, I don't think it's the third fight tonight that you've actually uh, commentated with me and the, the sponsor has been Johnny Two Thumb. I think they're trying to send you a message, Danny Bator. <laughs> Time for some more tattoos. More ink coming <laughs> Danny Bator's way. Maybe. So, uh, but yes, uh, as they're still in the ring, we want. It's in good shape right now. And congratulations once again to Darius Douch, Gavin Fuller, co-promoters co of this uh, magnificent event. Also, Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, the fighters are ready. Look at Nelson Lackey just smiling away at Lotus. Let's see how we go in this first round. We start very close in there. It's like very close distance for him to sort of... Uh, <laughs> yeah, to start. This is not really starting slow. No. Training the weight kicks early. Yeah. Oh. Nice big kick there from Nelson. Yeah. Does it again. Nelson Lackey in the red. Lotus in the blue. Feeling our just process, even though they've been exchanging kicks. Yeah. Another kick, nice kick there by Lotus. I've just noticed, so Lotus, Lotus has already switched stances. I don't know if he's, uh, he was just southpaw a minute ago. Um, southpaw right now. Not southpaw right now, sorry. <laughs> he was orthodox, now he's southpaw, but I believe he is southpaw normally. He has got a huge left kick. Well, he just felt it because that, right in front uh, of our commentary position, that was a nice kick to yeah. the body. That inside, Nelson's going to have to be careful, that inside leg left kick. And he's going to get that leg chewed up if he doesn't start moving. Yeah, he's going to have to be careful. I look at Lotus, he's got, Lotus has got big legs. He's got thick tie legs, so. Both in great shape. Yeah. Obviously, the taller fighter is Nelson Lackey. Yeah, by a fair bit. I think Nelson is aware that those those leg kicks are coming. He's starting to evade them now. That, there's that inside leg kick again from Lotus. And that left kick. I'd say that's what we'll see, be seeing a lot of from Lotus. Nelson just waiting. Check that low kick. He said the uh, the kicks of uh, Lotus are very impressive in the opening round. Yeah, they they look hard. That that right we're, kick. We're, from, we're feeling it. We're just sitting I'm here. Feeling. I'm like, eh. <laughs> um, that, but you know, Nielsen kicks hard too. He does, but uh, so far it's uh, it's the Lotus. power is coming from Lotus. Yeah. See, and then he throws a, a beautiful kick and lands, and then uh, gets blocked by. Uh, Lotus in receipt. Yep. Lotus has got that beautiful tie style, you know. Just waiting, picking his shots. I'd like to see Nielsen throw a little bit more. Last 10 seconds. 
said, five three-minute rounds. We've looked yeah. at rounds that have gone really quickly. This one seems to have gone on. Uh, seems the felt like four minutes on three. Yeah. So, but, uh, probably because we've felt those kicks. Johnny Two thumb, thumb, I'm sending Danny Bato your way. <laughs> round two. In round two, and then uh, see what uh, Nelson Lackey can do to uh, to get back on the offensive. Because said he's got powerful kicks oh, of his yeah. own, as you said, Danny. He just uh, had a really nice step up knee there as well. As I said, as being a longer fighter, he can use that to his advantage. Those big, big step up knees, and he's got like you know nice hands. He's got a good range with his hands too. So I like to see him use some use some punches and step up knees as well. Big left kick again from Lotus. That's oh, a nice kick. Oh, he's oh, hurt. He's hurt. He's hurt. Oh, David Tarong sure. just sort of separates him and, and wisely gives him an eight count. I want to get your opinion on that, though. Uh, he he was outstanding. He was, I don't know if you saw that, but he was Oh, he, he definitely was, was out, but it's like... Yeah. Uh, he wasn't he, down, that's what I mean. He wasn't down. I think in with these rules, it, it is still um, standing eight counts. Yeah. They are in, in this rule set, so I believe so. Because so he prevented uh, Lotus from following up and finishing it off. He did, but I believe in this sanction, we do have standing eight counts. So I think David Trunk made the right call there, I believe. Um, I know when I shadow judged the other week, same uh, rule set, that we got told standing eight counts apply. Yeah. So... Um, he always knew standing eight accounts apply, but again, it's like one more punch, that fight, that fight was over. over. Yeah. And he was still on his feet and, yeah. he, and, he, and prevented from following it up. So I found, I found that interesting. It's interesting. Oh, yeah, it probably, probably wouldn't happen in boxing, but again, Muay Thai's a bit different. A bit different. And you know, like the refs, are, you know, they're here to protect the fighters, I guess. And if you can say Safety something, you've got to... But again, Nelson Lucky is recovered. He's recovered. Like, he was done. Yeah. But that was a beautiful... Uh, but Beautiful strike there by Lotus. It was. Looking good, it, good looking good through two rounds. Oh, that left kick is dangerous. He needs to try and stay away from it. That's a nice kick there by Lackey. Yeah. But the elbow's coming from uh, Lotus. Lotus. Got his trap to get against his own corner. I think uh, Lotus wants to finish this fight. <laughs> yeah. That's what he's, I'm getting. He wants to take this victory yeah. and move on, but he's going to get all that elbow, the downward elbow. Yeah. Painful stuff. So he's mixing it up. The first uh, round was the kicks, and this one is the elbows and the strikes. Lotus is just really, we've got, what, 30 seconds left, really applying that pressure now. I think he just wants to seal the deal. I'm really impressed with him. Oh, he's uh, putting on a show so far. Nelson Lakey's in a world of hurt through yeah. two, two rounds, and he's uh, looking forward to the uh, the bell for the, to sound the end of round two. And, See what he can do to regroup, and his corner's going to take a good look at him because he might not be That's able to continue. I think he will. He will. He's a tough guy. Oh, but I he's think... in a world of hurt. And yeah, I mean, again, a very impressive performance. And uh, and he's taking on top tie. Like Lotus is good. Yeah, he's, he's great. Looks, well, he's fantastic tonight. So, but look, taking his time, get out of the corner as well. Watch the yeah. body language. So look, he's uh, round three. Gives the gratitude and. Uh, Let's see how, how much more punishment he can take. Lotus is starting fairly slow. Look at that. Oh. Down to the ground. And it's like it's, uh, it gets cut pretty quickly, though, Lucky, like to yeah. his, uh, his credit. But again, he is tough, so it wouldn't surprise me in the slightest if Lucky like, does get through the round, but I think Lotus is going to go after him. Yeah, I definitely think so. But yeah, Nelson is tough, and you never know. Like, you, you just never know what can happen. Nelson might get one shot, and it might be all over. You know, you just don't know. People can make those comebacks. Hey, you never know. He's just got nasty elbows, as we've uh, discussed. Yeah. And, he, uh, and Nelson, like, he does like those elbows and knees, so... Yeah, that's right. Looking for, he needs an elbow quickly. He needs a wicked elbow. Yeah, quickly. that's right. Look, catches the leg, goes to the body, but on retreat is lucky. Nelson's doing slightly better this round. He is. That's why I said it wouldn't surprise me if he just eludes and, uh, yeah. and uh, again, scheduled for five. So, but uh, Lotus now just stalking his opponent and uh, looking for the, yeah. the sweet spot. He's I landed. Landed in round two beautifully. 
I think Lotus is going to be just picking his shots and trying to pick the most effective He's very marks. patient, isn't he? He's not in a rush. He is. Body to, uh, shot to the body there by Lotus. Elusive, he's even elusive as well. His footwork is magnificent and his kicks are just yeah. lethal. He's got a beautiful style. We're very lucky in Perth to have uh, to have some great ties with great great styles. You know, great we've got talent on the fight tonight. Yeah, tonight, we've tonight. got Duke who was meant to be fighting tonight as yeah, well. Yeah, um, visa issues. Yeah, visa issues, but lucky to have him here in Perth as well. Lotus very patient, just stalking Nilsson down, waiting to pick his shots. Nice kick back there from Nilsson though. He's doing better this round. Yeah, he's, uh, he's come back quite nicely in a fight that was real we questioning whether he was, was going to get through this round. Yeah, I love that little lean back from Lotus. <laughs> the little counter yeah. left, the little but, counter kick. But I do think like uh, Lotus is just going through the motions this round, just doing what he needs to do to win. Yeah. Uh, look at that. Those leg kicks again. are hurting. Nasty. I feel like I can just feel every shot. See now, viewers around the world are enjoying this. Putting on uh, clinic is uh, Lotus. Yeah. Coming to the uh, end of round three. This one's gone quick, this round. Yeah, it has. As I said, I feel like the first round went a little bit longer than that round, for example. So, yeah. But, uh, and, uh, Bring it home round five. Nelson Lucky. Seconds out. Fifth and final round. Fifth and final round. And thanks to Johnny Two Thumb. Great supporters of the Muay Thai Grand Prix. Round five. They embrace show of respect, and uh, here we go. Three minutes left to get this one in the books. I reckon we're going to finish off with a bang. Well, Nelson Lackey's got to go after it. Yeah. His, his only choice is a knockout, so maybe he can land one of those elbows we've been, uh, oh, we've seen and uh, talked about. Good start so far. He's going after it. Yeah, Nelson's going hard. I'm so impressed with his, his heart. Like, he's tough. He's just biting down and going. Oh, nice high kick by Lotus, and has oh. he got him hurt again? Yeah, I'd say so, but Nelson, Nelson's still there. No, he's hanging tough. I think he, uh, I think he blocked it, but it still hurt. Yeah, I'd <laughs> say so. Lotus looks like he hits like, kicks like a truck. Yeah, and he's got such great movement as well. Yeah. You know, it's like when La Nelson like he's about to throw, he stepped out of the way, and it's like forced Nelson Lucky to change his mind because he knew he was going to miss. Yeah. Be interesting to see what's next for Nilsson and Lotus as well. What, what weight are we out here? We're at 67. That's right. What, what weight is? 67, the super yeah. walks weight division. We've got Damon Nelson and Max Vicker at 66.6, .6, so very close weight divisions. That's so. correct. It's both super walks weight, so but obviously agreed to weight. Yeah, so could see any of these, you know, either of these guys fighting either Damon and Max as well. Well, could we we're also be matchmakers no, tonight, so we're also in a four-man <laughs> tournament. Yep. So we don't, they just don't know it. No, heard it here first. <laughs> yeah. Breaking news here, the Muay Thai Grand Prix. We've yeah. been matchmaking all night. We have. Who knows, I might not be commentating with you next time. Maybe I'll be fighting on Muay Thai Grand Prix next time. Let's That's, hope. Uh, might be right. That's the aim. That's the aim. So just give us the point, because I'll be commentating. I'll just get a point up to you, so I might give you the fist bump fist through the ropes. There. Yep. But, uh, yeah, again, uh, Nelson Lackey, very tough. Very tough. Lotus is a slick. Yeah, he's, uh, he's just elite. Yeah. Look at that, look at that I, movement. I love that, I love that lean back encounter. That is probably one of my favourite techniques. Um, used by any fighter, to be honest. It's so, it's such a dominant technique to use as well. But yeah, it's just uh, this commanding presence in there, and it's like, you know, I'm the boss of this ring. Yeah. And he knows it. Su supremely confident in his movements, his abilities. Yep. Look, look, he's just, uh, he's just uh, putting on a show. He's sleek. I'm so impressed. But again, I'm so impressed with Nilsson's heart. Like, I, I didn't yeah. think he was going to make it. He was done. He was at, He was done in round two. And, and, uh, and they would have taken the eight count, recover. Let's hear it for both fighters. Oh, awesome fight, actually. Yeah. 
Yeah, it was very good. And then said, Nelson Lackey, very impressive, but uh, the Lotus will take the victory in this one and well deserved. About eight of the evening here, ladies and gentlemen, the main card of the Muay Thai Grand Prix. This bout proudly brought to you by Johnny Two Thumb. And we've got Yin here from Johnny Two Thumb to present the trophies. After five rounds of action in the super welterweight division, we turn to the judges for their decision. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, the blue corner, Lotus. There you have it. Lotus won. No great surprise there, Danny Batesall, but uh, incredible, great performance. And again, a lot of hard.